Today we've got the brand new Fox V3 RS helmet. Now, it's got a few updates from last year's brand new model launch, the V3, but it's got a few more tweaks to it, so let's take a closer look at it. Gone is the old fluid inside, and it's been replaced with the tried and tested MIP system. Now, it also has Verizorb, a dual density EPS liner to provide impact protection by spreading the forces of impact across a wider surface area. The shells are multi-composite technology that uses a combination of unidirectional, multi-directional pre-peg carbon and aramid fibres to provide the lightest yet rigid external shell. And an evolution to the MVRS system positions the visor with a centre post magnet and two side shear off screws. The visor is designed to flex under impact prior to breaking away to provide additional rotational impact management. The shell and EPS comes in four sizes for the best fit. Injected mesh vent screens maintain superior ventilation and airflow while providing protection from dirt and debris. The removable and washable ecstatic comfort liner with emergency release cheek pads is antimicrobial, which manages odor while wicking moisture away from your head. So there's not a lot of updates to the new V3 RS other than a few major ones with the screws on the side, so gone are the magnets. And I think maybe that was because a few riders were getting maybe complaints that Roost was knocking the uh, peak off. That won't happen anymore. And of course, the fluid inside is gone as well. Now, it used to be little gel pads on the helmet. And I think, again, some customers maybe complained about some pressure points. So now we've got the MIP system, which a lot of the top helmets run these days. Now, something I like about this helmet very much is the emergency cheek pads. It's got a system there that you can get your finger underneath and actually pull it down. Some helmets, it's a little bit tricky to get the emergency cheek pads out. This one seems to be quite simple, yet I don't want to test it and see whether it works or not. Now, for briefly wearing this helmet, the big changes that I noticed was it does feel a little bit lighter than the old V3 and the comfort of the helmet. The liner is very comfortable on this helmet and it's a real well-balanced helmet. Now, one little quirky thing that I really like about this helmet, and you can undo the chin pads here. So you can undo it, pull it out and wash these. These get really dirty and yucky and disgusting. Most helmets don't let you do that. This one does, I like it. My final thoughts on the Fox V3 RS helmet is it's great. The new updates are fantastic. The line is very comfortable. And of course it comes with all the safety features you expect from a premium helmet. Go and check it out at your local dealership.